So I have an idea. First, welcome if this is your first time. Like and subscribe, comment if you want, share if you want, but subscribe. If you ever drank water before, subscribe. This comment right here sparked an idea. I told my fitted watchers, I told my fitted lovers, I'm always gonna have fitted content for you. I wanna be successful with this channel. I wanna be successful as a content creator. Let me tell you, I've been grinding and working hard, trying to learn new things, trying to do new things, just for you. It's for you, it's not for me, it's for you. So that when you're eating lunch, eating dinner, eating breakfast, taking up, you have something to keep you entertained. What if, no matter if I have a vlog, an event, or something, or a video idea, I always drop a fitted video? Fitted content guaranteed every week. One video guaranteed every week, I promise. Fitted Fridays. So if you're here for fitted content, there will be new fitted videos every single week. I showed you my collection in this video, and I showed you the hats I regret buying the most in this video. Today, I'm gonna show you what my top 10 is. I even have an honorable mention, and I might, if you're lucky, and stick around in the video, I might just drop a fitted fact about myself, which happens to be, what is the most I paid for one singular fitted? One singular fitted. And I'm gonna be honest, I am embarrassed about it. But you're here for real, genuine content, and that's what I'm gonna give you. Okay, this is my top 10 fitteds in my collection, but don't ask me to do too much and put them in order. I'm not gonna lie, I wouldn't be able to figure that out. I actually kind of been on a streak of not buying fitteds, but one of my most recent pickups, which was a few months ago, was this bad boy from Toppers USA. Side patch, UV. I'm not someone that went too crazy with the real tree trend, but I will say this one just this one just spoke to me. I think the colors is a rainy day, fall vibe that you can just throw on with multiple browns and greens and just let it rock. I liked it so much so that I asked some friends that were in New York if anybody lived near the store. No one answered me. I contacted them on IG if they had any in store. They told me to contact somebody else. Another one of their Instagram profiles because I was like, I'll drive to New York to go get this thing. Instead, I just waited and waited and then I went on the site. They re-uploaded a half. I'm a one-fourth. 3 eighths when I don't have a haircut like this. And I still considered it and I'm like, nah, that's just too big, that's too big. Pause, that's what she said. But I kept checking, kept checking, and there was a 3 eighths. I didn't even question it. I had to cop this thing, this thing's heat. I forget what collection this was, but I do know the story. It was Capsule. Capsule super slept on. I don't know if they're as slept on as they were at one point, but they have a lot of heat consistently. A lot of good pricing and a lot of good deals when it's on sale or when they run sales. They're very, very fair compared to other stores that up their prices and whatnot. Capsule stay true as far as I know. That's the UV. The side patch is just like... It's nothing crazy in terms of like the detail, but for some reason, that just big side patch fits and looks good. It has the perfect Bangladesh build, not too boxy, not too round. Got the black and the brown that go well together. I don't know what you call that color, don't judge me, but it's just beautiful. To be honest, I've always had a thing for hats that have colors that don't necessarily make the most sense together. A blue, that different red, an orange, brown, black, and guess what, it goes all together so well. This hat right here, I forget the store. It is a favorite of people that see it when I'm wearing it. Gray bottom, I love gray bottoms. It's not really a tan or like a Vegas gold or anything, which in the photos I kind of thought it might be and still rocked with it. It's more so a stone and it really just makes it that different. And that's one of the best side patches in the game, by the way, everybody knows that. Truly a simple but very good logo at the same time. This hat gets me so many compliments. Again, Bangladesh, beautiful build. Although I don't know the store, the collection is Starbucks. I'm more of a Dunkin' guy myself. Don't judge me, I'm from New England. Even though I'm a Dolphins fan, baby. Come on, friends off, baby, let's go! Ah! Got another Mariners. Man, stores made like 10 different Snickers-inspired hats with the Mariners for whatever reason. It's off-white with that blue and red just pops. Ooh! All-star game, side patch. I don't... I don't know if that's a gray bill or not. No, it's definitely not. It's like, uh, you know what it reminds me of? It reminds me of when you have like a Snickers or a Three Musketeers and has that like little chocolate stuff inside. It's more like that color than it is a gray. And if you're a true fitted connoisseur, you appreciate 
appreciate the small details. You know when you're looking at the hat more and just notice details that you didn't see in the first pictures because you were trying to be so quick to cop it before it sells out? I know some people watching are probably like, man, where's the hat club stuff at? Where's the hat club stuff at? I think this is hat club's best collection, if not one of their best collections. Most of the hats in the collection actually are just executed so well. This one is one of the best hooks or collections, whatever you want to call it. Heineken inspired Astros. It's perfect, bro. Some people get mad at collections like, oh, why are you making a hat about that? Just make it colors or make it its original colors. You can't get mad at this hook. This hook, I'm a Yankees fan. I know I said Dolphins fans. People get confused how I'm a Yankees, Dolphins, Lakers fan. It's a long story. I'm not a bandwagon. I'll tell you that much. Okay, so don't judge me. Again, as a Yankees fan, this hat's perfect. Don't care though. Sorry. I forgot this wasn't the hats I regret buying video. I know I said people were probably waiting for the hat club heat. Now they're probably waiting for the my fitted heat. I forget if this is the 1.0 or the 2.0. I really don't remember and I really don't care. That's the best part of the hat and so is that. That's the same color. It's the same color as the UV basically that I just showed you. That's not a pink UV. It's like a salmon. It's like that seafood. It's like the summer and you know, you go to the beach and you get a little bit of seafood and you're eating that. Ah, 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 ah. I will say the only downside for me is that when I have a haircut or don't have a haircut, it still is a little tight. So I got to use my hat stretcher a little bit. By the way, hat stretchers kind of are like hit or miss. Sometimes they work, sometimes they don't. You can get like a good one hour of not having a headache out of it. But fitted lovers, no, we gonna rock our hats regardless. Another my fitted classic joint right here. Oh baby, you, you got what I need. Mudville 9, I think it was from a cereal pack. I really don't know, but I saw this hat in like a TikTok one time. Don't judge if my camera's good enough to pick up like the dirtiness of my hats. I wear my hats, I don't care, I'm not a reseller. I don't buy the stock, whatever. If you do, I don't judge you, good, good for you, good for you. But for me, I wear my hats. This is another hat that I get a lot of compliments on from people and fitted collectors especially. If I post a picture of it, they're like, oh man, that Mudville 9 joint's crazy. I've been trying to get my hands on that is it for sale and I'm like I wish you the best in trying to find it I pray for you I hope that you find it because I'm not a gatekeeper but you're not buying this off me five million because that's what it would cost and even then I would have to consider it I'm getting money just taking care of me girl Ooh, we're getting down to the nitty-gritty here I think we have four hats left Maybe three in the honorable mention. Yeah, yeah, three in the honorable mention. Okay, 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 okay. We're going back to Hat Club, keeping it in Nueva York. Oh wait, there's multiple Hat Clubs though. Drake, my favorite artist, and I needed to cop this. Drake's my favorite artist, and this hat, man, it's better in person because you don't really understand the blue. It's not baby blue, it's not sky blue. Maybe that's the title of it, but it's not the blue that you think when you first see it. I have another nothing was the same hat, which is fire, and it probably would make an honorable mention, but that blue is like a lighter blue, sky blue, more common one. This one you do not see a lot, man. Executed so well with the gold hints, and then kept it simple with the gray bottom. Cannot be mad at that at all. You can only fall in love like your high school sweetheart, college sweetheart. Any sweetheart, Valentine's Day's around the corner. If you have a toxic ex, don't call him. If you have an ex you miss, maybe call them. I know it's a fitted video, I got a little off topic. I'm a certified lover boy. I just told you Drake's my favorite artist. You might feel like nothing was the same. Oh, I can't rock a black nasty, ooh, this, ah, ugh, ah, ah. Then you probably aren't genuinely a fitted collector. No offense, I, like hats that I like. It's like music. People are like, you like country? You like rock and roll? I probably would say no, but there are country songs. There are rock and roll songs. There are electronic songs, dance hall that I do like. Just because I don't listen to the genre a lot doesn't mean that there aren't songs I like. Just because I have mostly colored bottoms and collections and this and that doesn't mean there aren't black nasties that I won't rock or will rock. No side patch. Black Nasty, would it look better with a gray bottom? Probably, I ain't gonna lie to you. Oh man, oh man, bro, you can't tell me this isn't heat. This is not heat. 
Is that what you're saying to me? Be honest in the comments right now. If you don't rock black nasties, would you rock this hat? Would this change your mind? And when you say yes and you go out and try and find this hat and you find it and it comes in the mail, you're gonna be like, thank you, Don's down for that, for putting me on. Thank you, man. Thank you for changing my life. And I'm gonna say, just make sure you subscribe. Make sure you like, comment, and share. I said no particular order, right? This hat is usually the hat that I tell people is my favorite. Let me tell you a little story. The hats that are sought after and sell out quickest are the easiest to find after because people want to resell them. You might have to pay more, but you will find them. This hat, when I first saw it, I was like, ah. I was going through that phase where colors were what's popping to me, right? And then I saw it again and it took me a month to find, and I had to pay resale on it, but I didn't care. I remember in my head when I was searching for it, I was like, I'll pay any price, and I got it for a better price than I thought I would, but then again, maybe not, because I don't think it was too sought after. Hat Club, man. I think it's like some, some World Series collection. Come on, bro. Look at that. You don't see this gray used too often, and then that red side patch with a hint of gold metallic. Ooh, and then you got the green bill. Green for money, 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 money. I don't know if the camera's gonna pick it up, but even if it doesn't, I'll let you know right now, there is a stain here. My favorite hat in my collection of almost 200 hats. The stain is from a little night out with my brother. I won't say his name, but he knows who he is. He had a little bit of a rough night. We were in the car, he starts yakking out the window. Window was open, oh, what's that hitting me? Whoa, whoa, what the, oh, what's that on my hat? Let's just say he had one too many drinks that night, okay? I wasn't even mad though, that's my brother, that's a hat. You know what, if I need to go on the hunt for another virgin in a couple years and pay $5 billion, I will, cause this YouTube channel gonna blow up and get me all the bread, cause y'all are gonna like and subscribe. Honorable mention, I remember when I wanted to cop this. This is when every single hat, no matter if it was trash, good, fire or not, it was selling out. I told my friends, I told my shoddy, if I don't get this hat, I will cry. Genuinely, I will cry. We were at a hotel in a casino getting ready to go to the club and my mind was on this hat. Exclusive fitteds. Some people don't like the corduroy brim. I loved it at the time and not a lot of hats had it. Not a lot of hats had it at the time. Pink bottom, man, this hat's just different. And I actually ended up crying even though I got it because it was tears of joy. And I'm pretty sure this hat might be sitting now because they restocked it like a year later. Okay, I know what I said at the beginning of the video. I'm gonna expose myself. I'm a man of my word. I do it for you. There's only a handful of people that know how much I pay for this hat. Definitely not only one of my biggest regrets in terms of fitteds and something I will never do again. I just got so caught up in the hype. I'm a human. I can admit that. I can admit my mistake. I'm not actually too ashamed of it, but I do know it was an idiotic mistake. Quick reminder make sure you guys like comment share comment on the videos I love interacting with you guys whether it's a question whether it's a comment whether you disagree with me you think one of these hats are junk you think it's better than what I described go ahead I'm never gonna get offended this is a community I love interacting with you guys so make sure you comment if you got to this point in the video if you finished the video much love I swear you're a real one this hat from my fit is if you know you know it wasn't a remake when I got it they remade it so it became even worthless at that point, one of the best side patches in the game. We've been over that. It's not focusing, but you know what it is. It is a beautiful hat, don't get me wrong. But the price I paid for it. You ready for this? $420. Don't forget, Fitted Fridays is now a thing. There will always be a fitted video no matter what. Even if it's the only video of the week, like this week actually. But make sure you're here to stay. Comment, like, subscribe. The videos are only going to keep getting better. Stay fitted. Keep rocking your fitteds. Curve up or don't. Buy one or don't. Hide it from your shawty. Hide it from your side piece because they're getting mad because Valentine's Day is coming around. You're like, baby, I don't got money for flowers, but I do got money for fitteds. Like, comment, subscribe so I can get monetized and recoup what I lost from this. And obviously, I almost forgot to tell you, I'm just playing. We'll talk soon. Cause when you up, God can strip it off from under you now. I'm learning first hand, wrong move, boy. That should have cost you. I got a lesson out of it. Learned how to use more tools.